Now, the Senate has denied approving the purchase of a new presidential jet for President Bola Tinubu and the Vice President Kashim Shatiba, contrary to recent speculation. Now, earlier reports suggested that President Tinubu was seeking National Assembly approval for funds to acquire a new presidential aircraft. However, during an emergency plenary session today, the Senate President, Gatsui Lapabio, clarified that these reports were the work of a fifth columnist attempting to destabilize the parliament. Akbabu's statement corroborated observations made by Senate Majority Leader Okbeya Mibamidili, who had stated that the Senate had not given any backing for the procurement of a new presidential jet. We sat here today. A section of the social media had also been circulating that we had gone into an executive session to discuss about the presidential request for a new plane and how we are going to uh, approve it. Mr. President, the essence of my saying this is just to make it clear and to, and to alert Nigerians that there is the presence of a fifth columnist and uh, some other propagandists who are doing everything possible to destabilize this country and also destabilize the parliament. Mr. President, I say for the record, as the leader of this Senate, that there is no request before this Senate as of yet. So there could not have even been a basis for us to debate whether we are going to approve Run the Senate by answering people in the social media. Because the social media is garbage in, garbage out. I was in uh, Zanzibar attending to inter-parliamentary union meetings when that uh, information went out that the Senate President has said he will approve a brand new plan for the President irrespective of whether they are suffering or no suffering. The, there was never a time such a statement came from me because I've never had any correspondence uh, to, uh, to, that, uh, to, to approve a plan or not to approve a plan. Well, the senators decided to cut short their recess, or originally scheduled to end on the 2nd of July, to convene an emergency session to discuss a bill amending the 2023 Supplementary Appropriation Act, extending its implementation until December the 31st, as per President Tinubu's request.